So if people want to take part in this, this is your opportunity. This is the, the big moment and um, we need to take advantage of it. Yeah, yeah, I, I definitely think that it's, uh, it's important that uh, we do not let them win by making it difficult for us to, to do this. Um, let's see, I, I had one more. Oh, um, yeah, for the people who aren't familiar with what you're talking about with the Washington, D.C. thing, uh, maybe explain to them the the plan and the backup plan for Unite the Right too. Well, first of all, let me make this very simple for people because that's what I'm trying to do is make this very simple. When you're dealing with a lot of people, you don't want people to, to have a lot of concern. You just want them to come and do what they came to do, which is demonstrate. Uh, so it, it, people should get on the email list. Um, you can get on the email list by sending me a message on Gab or on Twitter where my handle is at the mad dimension. You can send me an email to the mad dimension at gmail.com. Uh, you can look up my public Facebook profile, Jason Kessler. Um, send me a message through my website, jasonkessler.us. So that's number one is uh, get on to that email address. We're also working on putting up a website, which is going to be at www.unitetherightrally.com. And so it's going to provide people with the meeting details and so on and so forth uh, so they know where to go and when to go. But what I'm recommending is that people go ahead and book their travel arrangements now. You want to be uh, not in Charlottesville. You definitely don't want to book a hotel in Charlottesville, but get something to the north of Charlottesville, between Charlottesville and D.C., maybe 40 minutes out. It's about two hours between Charlottesville and Washington, D.C. And so plan A is that we're going to go into Charlottesville. Now, we're not going directly to Lee Park like last time. That is way too dangerous. Please do not go to Lee Park. What you're going to want to do is get on that email address uh, or – check the website and find out where our rally point is. We're going to decide that in the coming months once we have a decision on the court case and in consultation with law enforcement. And then we're all going to go into the event together in one group and the police are going to need to clear the way for us. Um, no one should have to fight to get into a public park and express their constitutional rights. So if there's any problem, like we don't get the permit, or um, the police are going to stand down, or there's too many Antifa in the way, whatever. So then we're going to get onto buses and we're going to drive for two hours up to Washington, D.C. And I've filed for a second permit uh, in Lafayette Park in front of the White House. So we'll go to the White House and we'll be able to speak in front of President Trump about the civil rights abuse abuse in Charlottesville, Virginia, which has locked up people uh, in a way that is unfair, which prosecutes white people worse than black people, has potentially denied our us our First Amendment rights for two years in a row. These are very important things. And I think people, when you're actually there, you're going to know that this is a moment in history, just like the first Unite the Right was but we're going to win this time. We're going to be able to speak. And the speaker list that we have, I can tell you is really out of this world. I can't say exactly who is speaking at this time, but we have a good speaker list and uh, you're really gonna wanna take part in this thing. So it's good. So even if we're able to demonstrate in Charlottesville, we're also gonna demonstrate in Washington, DC. So you wanna probably plan if possible to have August 10th through 14th freed up. If you're not from the Virginia area, then you're going to want to probably fly in on August 10th and we'll maybe have a meetup on August 11th. We'll do the demonstrations on August 12th. Uh, the one in DC might not finish up until the evening. So you might book your flight or your, your bus trip back for Monday morning or Monday afternoon. And that's all I've got at this time. Once you get on that email address, I'll send people the list of what you do want to do, what you don't want to do, and make it very simple for folks.